Meteorological winter is now under a month away, and the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration is calling for a wetter season in Indiana. Meteorologist Balan Salivari spoke with meteorologists at the National Weather Service this afternoon. He shows us what forecasters are predicting for the upcoming winter. Meteorologists are forecasting a tricky winter season. This year's winter outlook calls for a wetter winter with equal chances to see temperatures above or below average. Equal chances mean that uh, there's no strong signal to point us in one direction or the no another. Forecasters like meteorologist Sam Lashley are less confident in this year's forecast due to the lack of signals. There's not an El Nino or a La Nina expected, so there's a lot of variables at play for these winter outlooks. El Nino and La Nina are weather patterns driven by differences in oceanic and atmospheric temperatures in the equatorial Pacific. These cycles can greatly impact our winter weather. Without an El Nino or La Nina, forecasters are still able to use current and past observations. We look at a lot of things from uh, climatology, which is looking at past years that were similar, to uh, looking at our model trends for the future. And the signal is there in both what we've seen in the past and what our models are forecasting for the winter. To help increase confidence, meteorologists at the National Weather Service in Indianapolis will focus on short term data. In winters like this, we will look at a lot of things that are happening uh, in the North Atlantic and around the Arctic regions and we can only forecast those out about two weeks. Lashley believes this is still plenty of time to get the word out, but he says people should still plan ahead. Do what you need to do to get ready. Have that emergency preparedness kit in your car. Be thinking of those things as we head into the winter season. In Indianapolis, Balance Lavari, News 18. Lashley says the winter outlooks are updated every month. The next outlook will be available November 21st.